Hello everyone. Let's play another game here. Hopefully I don't lose again. But I did I started hitting a little better that last game. Still didn't help. But we're going to skip to Matt Latos here. Let's see. Hopefully my record gets a little better. Nine and fourteen. Eh, they won two games. Alright. Well, let's we'll see how this goes. Matt Latos. Oh yeah, I turned the sound up a little bit too. I noticed that the noise has been a little low in a game lately. Look at that. My pitching has a really good Major League Baseball rank, but my hitting is garbage. And most, and probably the reason why I'm not in last place is because... I'm letting the AI play some of my games. It's kind of sad. Out of those nine uh, wins, I only have one. Crap. From the oldest park in baseball, MLB The Show comes your way from Fenway Park in Boston. Right, Today, here we it's go. game two of a three-game weekend set between the Yankees and their bitter rivals, the Boston Red Sox. Okay. D. Gordon. Oh, Step great. I'm hitting now first. As we're ready to get this, this one go. underway. Wow. Underway at the ballpark this afternoon as the first pitch is in there for strike one. EK, as we take a look at our home nine as they take the field here this afternoon, they come in not exactly setting the world on oh, fire boy. as they've dropped five of their last eight ball games. At least beat Boston. And you know, the little things have been a recurring theme on these telecasts for years now. But oh, man. When you're in a losing streak like this, no matter how minor it is, it always seems like the little things are going the other team's way. That has certainly been the case these last few games. Now here's the first pitch. Fastball in there for a cold strike. That first pitch is going to be key all night long. If he gets ahead early with the fastball, that's when he can get tough to figure out, especially with Come the Come on, Arsenal give me a good one. Come on. Here's the 1-1. One, one. Swing and a ball hit softly wow. on the ground. I was but crap. a foul ball. One and two the count now. Here comes a 1-2. Tough pitch to lay off there, but he did, and it's even up at two and two. Now here it comes. Full count, three balls and two strikes. Right. Come on, right down the middle. There's Andrew McCutcheon. He'll hit next. The swing, and he pulls it down the line and deep. And yeah, home run. There. Yes. Gone, yes. Home run. I got a home run. Yeah. All right. A solo shot down the line in right as the Yankees will grab a one to nothing lead. Right on that nice. as he wraps it into center yes. field, the base hit. Freaking awesome hit. Yeah. Giancarlo Stanton will stand in with a run in, one out, and one on here in the inning. Now here's the first pitch. Running now is McCutcheon. Pitches nice. strike the throw. And they will not get McCutcheon here. He's in safely at second base. Now the pitch just does manage to oh. get a piece there as this is oh. bounced foul. Darn it. And a runner on second base. Don't get that bad up. He's ready now. The pitch. And rarely I whiffed. Totally whiffed that. that I always he get fooled by the third ball. Two away now. Matt Adams will stand in now. He homered in the ball game last night. First pitch coming. Ah. Oh. Over for a look here is Holiday, but this is well back into the stands. A foul ball. Come on, a pit, good pitch. Come on. He waits. Now the pitch. And one and one as this one's in on the hands. Come on. I want a good pitch. Ready now on one and one. On the run, that this was one in terrible. on him. He can't Freaking connect, hack. so he finds himself down one Darn. and two now. <laughs> That got in his kitchen big time right there. To two balls and two strikes now. Where do you go from here? I think he's set up for something off speed. If you can put that change up below his knees, 
he won't come within a foot of it. Now he goes the other way, and he got a lot of it high and deep to left center field. Trout has oh. to to the track, but he has My it to God, retire always the freaking out to the warning in track. The inning, come on. And it comes from a rather unlikely power source. On to the bottom of the first from Fenway, and it's an early 1-0 New York lead. That sucked. All right, let's get this going. Johnny Venner will step in now to lead things off in the home. Yeah, the I've been first. sucking in my right to the show. <laughs> and a ball one Darn it. Eric, you take a look at these guys as they take the field for the bottom of the first here this afternoon. They're on a nice little run. Winners of four of their last five ball games. And they got the road trip off to a rousing start. Coming up with a big win in game one. I doubt they'll all be that easy, but still, oh, come on. exactly what you're hoping for when you hit the road. Here it comes, two and one. And this pitch is hit foul off to the left and out of play, so the count goes to two and two now. Two-two pitch on the way. And this misses Ooh. now as Latos runs the count full to three and up two. on that, man. Now the pitch. And he takes oh. four. So the leadoff man is on wow. here as they're trying to get that run right back here in the first. Jason Kipnis will stand in now. And he'll likely have a look down to third to see if anything's up here with nobody out. He's set. Now the pitch. Now a ball grounded to short. This could be two. And he'll get the fielder's choice play at second, but that's all. Ugh. That's the kind of a hard play to get. Mike Trout will stand in. Comes off an 0 for 4 in last night's ball game. And a strike called at the knees, nothing in one. And here, you've got good speed on base and at the plate. So, on a ground ball, it's not a foregone conclusion. You're going to get an out anywhere. Here's Latos now on 0 and 2. And this is off the glove of Salto Lamacchia as it gets away. God dang it. And forget about the double play now as he'll move up to second here on the wild pitch. Now the one two misses. Oh, come two. on, give me that. Break. A big break. I don't think there's any question that should have been strike three. Now here's a ball hit hard on the ground to second. Pro gets All right. two down. I need to make sure I get this next guy out. Jose Batista to yeah, stand great. in, hoping for a reversal of fortune here as he's seen that average drop precipitously these past 10 ball games. Fastball too high to start him out here, 1 0. From the stretch. Two and Come on. Nine. Well, one of the real strengths of his game is that he's not going to go after a whole lot of bad pitches out of the strike zone. So he's a guy that's going to make you earn it by only swinging at strikes. Swing, hard hit ball to second. Throw on Whew. Maloney will there take care of him at but first, and his side is retired. Yoenis Cespedes will get his first shot here, and you can see he's got that average up near the 330 mark to begin playing. And here's oh. a ball hit in the air. That's going to be another fast hold down the middle like he was doing. Now the pitch. Ah, not the greatest at Darn it. thus far as he misses that pitch in the dirt and falls behind nothing in two now. Fouled back. The next 0 2. And a good bite to that slider uh. as he swings through it for the first out of the inning. Manny Machado. We'll get his first opportunity here. Took an 0 for 4 in the victory last night. Found a good swing there by Machado, but he pulls this one foul down the line and out of play. Machado now on 0 and 1. And this is hit hard up the middle. And into center field as he's aboard with a one-out single. 
James Loney will get his first shot here with the runner at first now and one away. Here's the first offering. And he starts the number eight hitter with a strike, nothing in one. You know, it's so important with guys like this to get ahead with strike one. Put them behind in the count and on their back foot right away. And a fastball in the dirt that's taken for a ball. 1-1 one, one on the way. Now a fastball here as this is yes. slashed the other way over yes. the third baseman's head. That a was fair a ball. freaking awesome hit. Yeah. Jared Saltalamacchia will stand in, and he'll be treated to a nice ovation here as one of the members of the 2013 club that, of course, won a World Series title here at Fenway Park. That is just so nice to see, and I think that will always be a pretty special memory around these parks. From the belt, kicks and deals. Swing and a miss on the slider, and he's quickly behind, nothing in two. Now he's probably lucky he didn't make contact on that one. Come set, now the pitch. And now a curveball as he's got to lean out of the way. That one nearly got him. Please, Hamill, don't hurt him. Here comes the one, two. And this is hit well toward yes. the hole. And a backhand I won't make this. First, but he can't flag it down. And they will hold that runner over at third as he'll move up only 90 feet, but the bases Mom, are loaded with Gordon. one away. D. Gordon, good hit. Come on. Crack at him here. Yeah. He flied out to lead off the ball game. And a fastball's off the plate away. It's ball one. Well, you know, three straight hits are bad enough, but now he's making things even worse by falling behind the next guy. And he won't bite at that one either. It's 2-0. Would you say he's not really finishing his pitches at this point? That's a good way to put it. It looks like he's aiming a little too Ooh, much. That would have been nice well. if I could just squeeze that in. Two and one now to Gordon. Oh, and this could be trouble now. It's three and one. Now the pressure will really start to mount out there. That strike zone's gonna feel like it's the size of a soup can right now. And he puts a pretty good jolt into this one, high and deep to center. Trout is there, and that should be deep enough to score the run. And it's a sack fly and an RBI. There we go. A two-nothing game. Wow, this is the greatest start. So two on for, with two away. Since I've played this game. <laughs> bring in the shortstop, Eric Ibar. And here's the first pitch. Here's a ground ball toward the hole, and it's going to get through for his second hit of the afternoon. And that'll bring home run number three. It's now a 3 nothing. My God, I got three runs. Holy crap. Andrew McCutcheon. Let's see what he can do here. Two on, two away, two home here in the inning so far. First pitch on the way. And he'll take strike one on the fastball, registering at 93 that time. Runners lead from first and third. Here's the pitch. And that misses one and one. The one one now to McCutcheon. Now a fastball. Look out as he has to duck out of harm's way there. I think he took a little exception to that location. Yeah, and so would I if I was down there. If you want to work inside, that's fine. Now, meanwhile here, this ball's hit fairly well down that left field line. And it's nice. going to stay fair. It's a home run. Yeah. Holy crap, I have six runs. Oh, my God. That's almost more than I've gotten the in this freaking game. Eighth home run on the season for him. As they pile on, it's now six to nothing. Sure sign that trouble is afoot as there is already some action in that bullpen now and we're just in the second inning. Lays off the slider and it's one and one. I think that man right there is reaching the end of his wits. Oh, his team is absolutely imploding right now and it basically... Now a hard hit ball back up the middle. Throw from a knee. Yes. It's too late. And that will be... Oh my God. Single. Nice. Matt Adams. We'll dig in here. He flew out his first time around. First pitch coming. Lined hard to center field. Come on, drop. And that'll get yes. down for a base hit. Joanna Cespedes will get a shot now with two on and two out here in inning number two. First pitch to him. 
And a first pitch slider is right there for strike one. Time to play pitching coach. What's he doing wrong? More of a question of what's he doing right? It ain't much. Oh, and darn it. And he runs the fastball by him at 94. It's 0-2. There's not a whole lot of conviction in that swing. It was almost like an afterthought, like an emergency hack. Low and away with that one, it's 1-2. and two. A classic strikeout pitch there on 0-2. Oh it's one he loves going to, but great recognition there at the plate to lay off. And we'll have to leave it there. This is strike three, and that will retire the side. But not before uh. five across the plate, with the big blow being this three-run home run. We'll go to the bottom of the second, and it's all New York, 6 nothing Yanks. And a fastball runs in a bit too close for comfort that time. And that guy right there is the beneficiary of all these early runs. He's got to be the happiest guy in the ballpark. And this will get through into left for a leadoff hit. Need a double play. Come on. Matt Holliday will get his first shot here. A couple of hits in four trips last night. Uh, couldn't quite hold back that time as the changeup fooled him for strike one. He's ready. Now the pitch. And Holiday will not offer at that one. It's a ball and a strike. Has a look. Now the pitch. And he turns this one around high oh and God. deep to center field. But not quite oh, enough. How do you jump? The center field what the wall. freak? Dude, how do you... I don't know how to do that. Right. Stand in, hoping to turn things around from the loss last night. He was 0 for 4 in that ball game. First pitch is a slider called for a strike. And this is a big spot right here. You've got to get something out of this, even if it's just a run or two. Grounded foul. From the belt, the pitch. And this is hit sharply on the ground toward the hole. High bar for one. Throw Why the first the freak he throw it like that? So they just get the one there. Oswaldo Arcia will dig in, and this season certainly hasn't been all that kind to him as he enters play with the average down in the 230s. Runners lead from first and third. Here's the pitch. That misses wide. One ball and one strike. That change up away is his ground ball pitch. That's a good job to hold off. And this will be fouled away. Runners are at first and third, one away. Lays off oh. two and two now. Pause, now the pitch. And now a pitch. No! And oh, my God. Ball as this one's heading for the left field corner. Wow, what the fray. I hate it. This Tyler game has like a rubber band effect. If you do uh, get a lot of runs, they get a lot of runs. It's freaking both five games. Not much going on there at all. Every sport game seems to have like a rubber band effect, just like freaking racing. The next pitch. Perhaps a little why they got that. Very patient here in these opening few innings. And I think that's exactly what they're going to need to do. The more hitters counts that you can get yourself in, the more fastballs you're going to see. And this is a good fastball hitting team. Latos take charge himself out there, and there's two down. That's a disappointing at bat there with runners in scoring position. Even early on, you've got to be able to cash in when the opportunity presents itself. Because you never know how many more you're going to get. And he gets under this one a bit as this is lifted into center field. And McCutcheon will put this one away, and the inning is over. Manny Machado will lead things off. Bottom third of the order set to go here in the third. Now a fastball to start the third. That misses. It's ball one. And even though he's given up his share of hits so far, he still hasn't walked anybody, so at least he's got that going for him. And oh, looked like ball two below the knees, but it's ruled a strike, and that evens the count at one and one. Here's a hard hit ball oh. that will be caught out there at short. Definitely well hit, but the leadoff man's retired to start the third. James Loney will stride in again. He singled and later scored his first time. Now he turns on a fastball here and sends it to deep right field. 
And that will hop over the wall nice. now as he'll be awarded second base here. It's a ground rule double. And this could wind up being a bullpen kind of game as we've got action down there right now when we're only in the third inning. First pitch swinging as this one's hit on the ground to second. On to first, and Salto the Machia grounds out here, two away. D. Gordon will stand in for the third time now, still without a hit, so that streak could be in a bit of jeopardy. And I think that's in the back of his mind, but it's not something. Oh, he's come really on. Focused on. He just wants to get up there and put a good swing on the ball. He's set, now the pitch. And he pulls it to deep right field. Uh. Batista is there, and he puts this one away for the third out. So a great job there of working out a potential trouble. Jason Kipnis will stand in. He reached on a fielder's choice his first time. Latos back to work as he gets ahead of the first man to greet him here. Nothing in one. And you know, if you're going to challenge a guy up in the zone with a fastball, why not do it on the first pitch? A lot of times he's going to be taken anyway, and you just bought yourself a strike that you can not uh. anything off of. And a throw over the head of Loney. Mike Trout will stand in. He grounded out his first time. First offering on the way. Good change up there to start him, but it drops a little low for ball one. He's ready now. The pitch. Kipnis runs. Pitch is a cold strike. The throw. Oh. Far too late as he steals second with ease. Here's Trout waiting on the 1-1. Here's a no. ball back up the middle. And that's through into center field. Base hit. Kipnis will take the turn and head for home. And they Come show on. a little oh like my God. the lead shrinks to 6-2 now. Jose Batista will stand in. He grounded out his first time. First pitch coming. He'll start him here with a changeup, but it's taken for ball one. Here comes the 1-0. Curve Come ball on. Down and misses ball two. Hey, it's danger any way you look at it right here. You've got a base open, but you've got an even better hitter waiting on deck. So I don't think I'd be working around this guy. I'd be forced to go right after him. McCutcheon is right there, one down. Long throw to third. Come on. And he'll get into third here on the flyout, so he's 90 feet away here with one gone. Victor Martinez will stride in again. He singled and later scored his first time. And that's in there for strike one. Tries to shave the corner with that pitch, but it's one and one. From the stretch. Over for a look here is Cespedes, but he won't have a play. It's a foul ball. Comes set, now the pitch. And this will be fouled away. Now another one, two. And this will come get on. Uses. That's lined into right center for a base hit. <sighs> so one gone in the inning here with the runner at third. Time to take Matt Wade. Here's so. the left fielder, Matt Holliday. Here's the first offering. First pitch is a fastball inside, 1-0. Oh, oh. And some action out in the Yankee bullpen now as a right-hander starts to loosen up. Started to go around, but it's ruled strike one anyway. 1-1 one, one pitch on the way. Swing and a miss on the fastball, and it's 1-2. and two. Yeah, and I don't think I'd be in any big hurry to challenge this guy again. I'd see if I could make him go out of the zone. Maybe... And sorry to interrupt, but the play has been made for the third out. My God. Inning over. Eric Ibar will try it again. He homered back in the first inning of this one. Here's the first pitch to him. And that one's in on the hands to start the inning. It's ball one. The 1-0 pitch. And ooh, looked like a definite pitcher's pitch there on the inside, one and one. Makeup call there? Um, I don't know, but let's just say they're even. Fastball called strike. One and two. Corner paint right there. 97 miles an hour. What are you going to do with that? Here's Kipnis now, the second baseman. And a bit of a high throw that time, but no problem over there at first as they record the out. Andrew McCutcheon 
will stand in. Two hits in two trips thus far. Now the first pitch. And look out as this bat shatters on impact. And he'll find a way to dodge the shrapnel out there to make the play for route number two. Giancarlo Stanton will stand in. A strikeout victim his first time and then a base hit last time around. Now the first pitch. And a good slider here to start the at-bat, but it's ruled a ball, 1-0. The 1 0 home. Downstairs, two balls and no strikes. You still come after him now on 2 0? I think you have to be a little careful, but yeah, I don't think you can just give up on him. Outside, 3 0 now. And even on 3 0, it's no given that he's going to be taken up there. We've seen him go after pitches in this spot before. He's not going to hold back. No offer from Stanton. It's ball four, so he'll head down to first. Matt Adams will come forward now. He has flied out and singled so far. Now here's the first pitch. Fastball off the plate away. It's ball one. Just because he's thrown five straight balls doesn't make this an automatic take. Especially nice. the guy in this part. There we go. And that'll get through into center field for a base hit. Looks like it. Giancarlo Stanton, huh? Joanna Cespedes will stand in for the third time now. Still without a hit, so that streak could be in a bit of jeopardy. And I think that's in the back of his mind, but it's not something Darn it. he's really focused on. He just wants to get up there and put a good swing on the ball. He waits. Now the pitch. Ball swung on and lifted in the air with some carry out towards left center. Ah. Under it now is Holiday, and he's got it no problem to end the inning. Yanks strand a pair as they're unable to add to their 6-3 to three lead. First pitch coming. David Wright is in to start things off here as he looks at a cold strike. It's nothing in one. Yeah, showing no fear there. He put the pitch right at the letters away, but that guy didn't want any part of it. Oh, my God. And that's a base hit, so the pressure's on to open up the inning. Oswaldo Arcia will stand in. An RBI yeah, double time to, to his credit some the first time around. In. Here comes Yankee manager Joe Girardi on his way to the mound. And his arrival is going to signal the end of the afternoon for the starter, Matt Latos. Danny Farquhar is going to come on and make an appearance here, though I suspect even he couldn't have predicted he'd be taking over in just the fourth inning. Off the plate, one ball, one strike. Now, how important is it going to be for this guy to throw that curveball for strikes? Nope. Oh, man. He necessarily needs to ever throw it for a strike. I mean, if it's around the plate and he's getting guys to go after it, it's doing its job. But if he starts to get too high or too far outside, then it's just an easy take. Therefore, it is Stanton, and he's got it for the first out. Tyler Flowers will dig in. He popped out his first time. Now here's the first pitch. And a cut fastball in there for a strike. It's 0-1. He's ready. Now the pitch. And he powers a cut fastball by him that time, and he's in charge now. Nothing in two. Uh, you can tell he's still frustrated after that first. And hold on there. He yeah. got him. Trying there to swipe go. second base, but he's gunned down for the out. The right-hander deals on one and two. And the nice. got him swinging. Strike three, and the side is retired. Manny Machado will make his way towards the box to lead off the fifth. Here's the first offering. Outside target here, and he hits it for strike one. And now Boston's bullpen springs into action. A left-hander and a right-hander begin to throw. And that's inside, off the plate with the fastball. It's one and one. Here's the pitch. Slider clocked in the mid-80s there. It's a ball and two strikes. Here's the one-two. Here's Machado with a drive. Well hit to deep left field. Yes. And a great start to the fifth. That ball is yeah. gone. A home run. Rob Wooten 
is going to take over here in inning number five as it's going to be up to their bullpen to try and keep them in the game here. And here's the first pitch. Now a swing and a hard hit. Ah. And Martinez will take this one to the bag himself for the out. Jared Saltalamacchia will dig in with one in and one away. Now some action out in the bullpen as a lefty and a right-hander begin throwing. And a good spot for that pitch is it's chopped foul. And the pitch. Off the plate, one ball, one strike. Well, the Yankees with their three home runs now still have a ways to go to match their record for a single game. Twice in their history, they hit eight of them, most recently in 2007. One, two. And he'll try to get him fishing there, but he won't offer in the dirt, and it's back to even at two and two. Here it comes. Hit hard, but fouled off to the left, and that'll keep you honest as a third base coach. Sets the 2 2 pitch. Pitch in the dirt, oh swung on, and missed for strike three as they'll need to throw to first here. Throw to first will take care of him. Score it 2 to 3 on the put out, and there are two gone now. Z Gordon get this. will stand in here. He's 0 for 2 with a sacrifice to this point. Swing and a rocket. Oh, to third. darn it. This won't get hit right toward him. Right as he spears it at third to end the inning. Yanks able to add yeah, on one more via the yeah, solo seven. home run. Bottom of the fifth coming up. It's the Yankees seven and the Red Sox three. Johnny Venner set the plate now as he looks at strike one. This man out for his second inning of work. Did a nice job getting them one, two, three last time around. Yeah, but that was against the seven, eight, nine guys. Things may uh. be a little more difficult here now that he has to face the top three in the lineup. Now a ball fouled down the right field line out of play, so that'll move the count to two and two now. Here he comes on two and two. Now a ball hit hard towards come the hole, and that'll just sneak past his outstretched arm, a base hit. Jason Kipnis will step in. Singled and came around to score his last time. And this ball's going to find the seats down the left field line. Foul strike one. Come set. Now the pitch. Good cutter there, and he's got him behind the eight ball now. 0 and 2. From the belt. Kicks and deals. Oh, he got his fastball that time. Ah. He sent into right center. That's a base hit. And they keep Darn rolling. It, man. Their runners at the corners. We can't still stop him from freaking out. hitting the ball. Mike Trout will dig in, one for two. He grounded out the first time and followed that with a base hit in his second plate appearance. There's a fastball missing down and away for a ball, 1-0. and oh. Went about halfway there, but it's a called strike regardless. Here's Trout waiting on the 1-1. Swinging a ball hit hard on the ground at first. Ibar for one. On the first, but not in Freaking time. Freaking stutter. Fielder's choice Come on. and an RBI. Jose Batista will step in now. He's bounced out and flown out in his first two plate appearances. Fastball, and he's got a duck away for dear life there. Can't imagine guys like that too much. Yeah, not too much indeed. Meanwhile here, the throw down to second is not in time, and it's a stolen base. The 1-1. Right there at the belt, 1-2 and two now. Very patient here to start the at-bat. Maybe even a little too patient because now he's down one and two. Yeah, and I don't think he's going to get anything better than that to hit. And that's taken in straightaway right. Will he try from second? And he's up to third safely now with two gone in the inning. Victor Martinez will step in. An RBI single his last time around. In there, no balls and a strike. Surprising to you guys that it looks like they're going to pitch to him? It is to me. I mean, I wouldn't go anywhere near this guy with a base open. That's in there as well. It's a quick 0-2 count. Pause. Now the pitch. And a half nice. swing there as they there tie him up inside for the third strike. And the inning is over. Eric Ibar will stand in again. But first
Flash you back to the very first inning of the ball game. And here you go, oh, no. a solo home no. run that had him off and running early on. <laughs> and now pitch on the way. Cut fastball in there ah. for a called strike. The pitch. And this ball ah. heading for the seats down the right side as the count will move to 0-2 now. Now here's the pitch. And he turns on this one and yanks it foul and back out of play. The 0-2 once more. The next 0-2 misses and that'll move it to 1-2 and two now. Here we go on an 0-2 count. All you have to do is start that thing right down the middle of the plate and then just let it work its way in. Hopefully get a swing through or maybe even a shattered bat. Here comes a 2-2. Cutter and it doesn't make it back. 3-2. And, and when you right. need a shutdown inning, a leadoff walk's not on the agenda. You better bear down right here. And he looks at a cold strike wow. three. Darn it. The cut fastball's in there, and that's out number one. Andrew McCutcheon will stand in as we'll flash you back to the second inning as you get a look at this key three-run home run. McCutcheon will spin and yank this one down the left field line, but this will find the seats foul. Now the pitch. Oh, he had a fool uh, there. No darn it. And two strikes. Really a good job so far by this guy out of the bullpen. Yeah, he's come in and really put his stamp on this game. He's throwing a lot of strikes. That's what you want. And he looks at a ball, one and two. The one, two. Hits softly to the right ah, side. Crap. Throw in time at first. Darn it. Number two. Two away now in the Yankees' sixth. And set to stand in the ultra dangerous Giancarlo Stanton. This ball's here ah. in the air down the right side and out of play. 0 and 1. Here's the pitch. Ah, he's got to be oh more disciplined God. here. It's 0 and 2. Oh, man, what a perfect pitch right there in a perfect spot. And that's exactly how you have to attack a guy like this. He wasn't even close on that pitch. Good job of holding up on the low ball there, and it's one and two. Here comes a one-two. Now a line drive that's oh, going to be on. caught out there at short. Unlucky that time, and that ball will end the inning. Holiday will stand in as they'll lead things off for the Red Sox in their half of the sixth. And that misses ball one. Well, you know, if there's anybody in this lineup capable of getting a rally started, this is the guy right here. One and one. Pitch on the way. Keeping it down here as it's to one and two. And the pitch. And this is fouled back and out of play. Here he comes again, one, two. To two balls and two strikes now. Now here's the pitch. And he just manages to stay alive here as he fights this one foul. Now another two, two. Now here's another pitch fouled off and heading for the seats. And he's just fighting to stay alive here, still two and two. Up and in here as he had to bend out of danger. Yeah. Not trying to hit him, I don't think. But sometimes you need to. Oh come! What off. are you doing? Like to oh do. my god! David Wright will dig in now. One for two to this point. Charlie Furbush will get the assignment on the mound here as he'll enter with the runner at first and nobody out. David Wright will be the first to stand in against the new pitcher as he'll do so with the runner at first and nobody out. And here's a fastball called for strike one. Swing and a ball hit hard on the ground. Oh, come second. on. And a good effort on the dive that time, but this will get by him for a base hit. Ridiculous. And that runner will go no further than second as there are two aboard now. Oswaldo Arcia will step in. One for two in the ball game. There's a strike at the knees, 0-1. Tough spot here for a left-handed hitter facing a guy that's exceptionally tough on lefties. 
Yeah, you generally get so many at-bats against right-handed pitching. Now you're in a good RBI spot, and you're stuck facing a guy like this. A big pitch here, one and two. Oh, and he drives one into deep serious? right center. A leap, but he oh can't my. bring it back <laughs> into the park. Oh, come on. Run. I'm getting really ticked off now. So a three-run shot oh to right my center God. field. Home this game really freaking As that'll pull him into a tie at 7-7. Seven, seven. Now a change up in on the hands that evens it at oh one and one. Oh my god, give me a break. I'm, oh. This is oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. You freaking serious? Johnny Benner will dig in. He singled and later scored his last time. And that misses inside. Oh, oh my God! He's starting to look a little bit oh frustrated out there. He's looking for the right formula, but he hasn't been able to find it. And the one only sent out to stupid. straightaway center field. Catch is made out there by McCutcheon, and that's the first out. This is really dumb. This is really freaking stupid. And that's just one of the few balls that really hasn't taken off today. We've seen some balls really jump off the bat so far, but not there. First pitch coming. Fouled straight back. Action in the bullpen now as a right-hander begins to throw out there. From the belt, the pitch. Back-to-back -back fastballs here as he takes control 0-2. Yeah, and it doesn't look like he's trying to get a ground ball here. He's coming right after him trying to get a punch out. Curveball, but he can't get him to chase it 1-2. and two. Ball 2. And when he's down 0-2, he's smart enough to know guys are going to try and get him to chase. So now at 2-2, two and two, he's got Come himself on. back in a spot where he doesn't have to go after a pitcher's pitch. A ground ball to third, and they could get two. One there, back to Loney, but they can't quite get him as it'll go as a fielder's choice. Mike Trout will stand in. He grounded into a fielder's choice last time. And a fastball there is inside as that one backed him up a bit. I doubt he wanted to get in quite so tight with the hard stuff there. But, hey, this is a guy with good opposite field power, so you don't want to just give him free reign to lean out over the plate. No offer oh. on that one. Two balls and a strike. <laughs> oh, holy well, crap. Right here, he ain't missing by much. Not getting too many favors behind the plate. Over towards the dugout, but this one will get into the stands. The 2-2. Two -two. And he's getting his money's worth up there now. It's full three and two. From the stretch. Foul back. Three and two. Here it is. Boy, really making him work now. Why are they so freaking hitting so good this time? Why? steady at three balls and two strikes. Is it because I... Oh, shot to center field. Back goes to center fielder, but this oh my God, screw this game. I'm tired of it, and it's stupid rubber band of freaking effect. Come on. It does this every time. Freaking dumb game. Oh, my God, I'm getting so tired of this freaking game at this point. Jose Bautista is in with two away as he takes a ball, 1-0. Oh. This ball freaking will be stupid game. Foul. Freaking retarded garbage game. Here's the 1-1 one, one pitch. This year sucks. Late on the fastball there as this one skied out toward right. Freaking retarded and they'll get game. There in plenty of time retarded to put this one away. freaking that game. The inning. So they nearly bat around here as eight men come to the plate in scoring five. Yeah, we see a lefty and a right-hander start to loosen up in the bullpen. First pitch on the way. First pitch of the inning here is wrapped right back from where it came, and that'll get into center field for a leadoff single. Yoenis Cespedes will stand in now in what could be a real make-or-break situation. You think at this point you have to get something out of this inning. The further you get into that bullpen, the tougher it's going to be to claw back from this deficit. He's set, now the pitch. Now a swing and a little tapper to the left of the mound. 
And he won't even think about second as he'll flip on to first for the sure out. Manny Machado will step in as the possible tying run, but just a single here could make this a one-run game. First offering on the way. In tight here with the first pitch fastball that's 1-0. This is a spot where it helps to have a two-seam fastball like that so you can work in on the right-hand pitch. Oh, my God. And he holds up here, but the pitch is a cold strike anyway. That's so stupid. Here's the 1-1. One -one. A little bit outside. 2-1. and one. A 2-1 offering. And that one finds the target on the outside corner. Two and two. Two, two. He'll fight just to stay alive here as this is fouled away. Here's the two and two offering. Now a ball hit back up the middle. Throw in the dirt to first, and he can't come up with it cleanly. Throw is low, and he can't get it to stick in the webbing. James Loney will step in, a ground out victim as last time. First pitch to him. Fastball's too high here, 1 0. Oh. Very tempting up there, but that's also a pitch that a lot of guys will pop up. So that's a nice job of laying off. Here's a ball lined into left center field, and it's going to get down for a base hit. Scoring is the runner from third, and that'll <clears> cut <throat> the lead down to one. Troy Patton will come on and try to get out of this mess here as there are two on with only one away. Now some action out in the bullpen as a lefty and a right-hander begin throwing. Here's the first offering. Fastball misses in the dirt as he tried to get him to chase the low one. 1-0 on the way. A little over-anxious that time as it's a ball and a strike. Now the 1-1. One, 1-2 one. One now as that's in there at the knees. Here's the lefties offering on 1-2. and two. And a change up here, but that's taken low in the dirt for a ball. Here now the 2-2. Two, two. Doesn't offer it the oh circle change gosh. there, and it goes full 3-2. and two. And now on 3-2, do you put any thought into sending the runners here with one away? And he misses ball hmm. four. So now that potential tying run scoots up 90 feet to third base. D. Gordon will stand in one more time, and fortunately for him, he'll get a fifth chance here to extend that hitting streak. Yeah, he hasn't had the oh, same success on. that the rest of the guys have, but that could all change in <laughs> one swing. He waits, now the pitch. Late decision oh, to that time, and as a result, it's 0-2. Now with two strikes, he can put the ground ball on the back burner and really go after the strikeout here. And this is swung on and missed. A uh, huge uh, out there as the bases will stay loaded with two away now. And now a crucial spot. Bases loaded. Two men gone. And that'll bring in the shortstop, Eric Ibar. And he gets ahead here with the fastball. Strike one. He's set. Now the pitch. And Ibar will lay off that one. It's even at one and one. Here's the one-one pitch. Right back to the outside part of the plate, but that misses as well. It's two and one. Yep, they went right back to that same pitch on the outside corner, and that's a good job of laying off both times. Oh, come it's on. Lucky to make contact on that one as it's chopped foul. Here's the two and two home. Now this is on the oh, ground to second. Is he going to get out of this? Over to first. He does get out of it, and the inning is over. Victor Martinez will get another Struck out swinging his last time. Fernando Rodriguez will get the ball now as he'll take over on the mound to start the home seven. Victor Martinez will be the first one to greet him here as he'll be forced to turn around and hit from the left side now. Starts him out with a curveball for a strike. Now here it comes. Ball one. 
Now here's the pitch. Swing and he pulls the fastball high in the air toward deep right center. Catch is made out there by McCutcheon and that's the first out. Matt Holliday will get another shot now. Two for three in the game. In tight here with the first pitch fastball that's 1-0. and oh. Now the pitch. Up top, it's 2-0. and oh. Now the pitch. And a good comeback fastball there. It's two balls and a strike. Here it comes. He's fallen behind now, 3-1. and one. He knows a drill out there. You've got to make him swing the bat and not be giving up walks at this stage of the game because those could be fatal. Now the three and two pitch. Swing, hard hit ball to second. And boy, just about overshot his man at first, but he's able to keep a foot on the bag over there, and that's out number two. David Wright will step in. Singleton came around to score his last time. Off the plate and away there. One ball, no strikes. And the pitch. Ball two now. And on 2-0, oh, this is where he's the most dangerous up there. I know it's a fastball count, but I would maybe think about something else. 3-0 and oh now. 3-0 oh is on the way. And he'll just make him throw one over here, three and one. And at the plate, he might have been told, look, you're taken until you get a strike. Not a bad idea. Now a swing and a sharp ground ball to third. They throw on to the first baseman, Loney, and the side is retired. Dane De La Rosa will be summoned from the bullpen now as he'll take over to start inning number eight. Andrew McCutcheon will stand in. He homered back in the second inning of this one. Now a swing and a sharp ground ball toward the hole. And just past his outstretched glove into left, a base hit. Giancarlo Stanton will dig in. He lined out hard in his last time around. Here's the first pitch to him. Running now is McCutcheon. Pitches a cold strike to throw. And they will not get McCutcheon here. He's in safely at second base. Now action in the bullpen as their closer starts to get loose out there. And that swung on and fouled straight back. Comes set. Now the pitch. Off the plate at 94, 1 and 2. And even on 1 and 2 now, you've got to expand the strike zone a little up there. You can't go down looking. Uh, you've got to put uh, this ball in the play. Throw on to first is in time to get him. So that'll go down as a strikeout and a two to three put out for route number one. Matt Adams will have a shot at driving home that possible tying run that's standing at second. The fastball here is he'll take a look at ball one. One and oh. One oh. Line drive. Base hit left field. Oh, it would have made that. Now, so that Darn it! Run will be forced to hold on at third here, still with only one away. Yoenis Cespedes will stand in one more time. And fortunately for him, he'll get a fifth chance here to extend that hitting streak. Yeah, he hasn't had the same success the rest of the guys have, but that could all change with one swing. Runners leap from first and third. Here's the pitch. Her ball close, but it's one and one. A look here at the hits per side here in the late going. And he finds a way to catch the zone here. It's one and two. Still no fastballs in the at bat. It's been all off speed. Uh, that's definitely by design. He's such a good fastball. Ah, and meanwhile, this pitch gets away from him. A throw to the plate, and he is. What? No, he was safe. Screw this. He was safe. Oh, my God. Come on. Will dig in. Had a three run homer his last time. And he swings through a fastball and doesn't catch up with it. It's 0 and 1. This fastball is looking pretty lively right now. Outside for a ball, 1 and 1. Pitch on the way. 
And he'll try to take control of the inside part of the plate here as that misses. I'll say this. He wasn't going to get his arms extended on that one. To two and two now. Four pitches. Fast, slow, fast, slow. EK, you thinking fastball here? That seems to fit the pattern, but you better not get too predictable out there. Guys will catch on quick. The 2-2 two -two coming. Now here's a ball hit hard on the ground to second. And the throw to first is in time, one gun. Tyler Flowers will dig in. He singled his last time around. Curveball, and that misses in the dirt for ball one. Here's the pitch. 2 and 0 now. Yeah, that's a good spot to miss against a guy like this. He loves that pitch up in the zone. Most power hitters do, so that's not a bad idea to give him one above the letters. Outside, 3 and 0 now. Here comes the 3 0. And he takes ball four. So a good job out of the nine hole and getting on base as we go back to the top of the order. Now action in the bullpen as their closer starts to get loose out there. Grounded foul off to the left near Brian Butterfield in the third base coaching box. Runner at first here, one man out. He's ready now, the pitch. And this misses the outside corner, so it's knotted up at one and one. From the belt, kicks and deals. It swung on and missed the throw. Way late, and he's in there easily at second. Now the one-two. Oh, he lifts a high pop-up. Drifting into foul territory on the right side. There to take it in is Loney now for route number two. And this is over his head at third. Uh. And he'll make it up to third here thanks to the throwing miscue, and we'll see how they want to score this play. Jason Kipnis will dig in with a very important insurance run 90 feet away at third. Fastball off the plate away. It's ball one. And he looks at a changeup in there, one and one. Oh, he's, he's got a legitimate gripe right there. I don't know about that one. Took him right up the ladder that time, and it's one and two. And we've seen guys swing at that four-seam riding. I'm oh, sorry to interrupt, but that's the third strike and the third out. Side is retired. Red Sox leave one. They lead it 9-8. Mark Melanson is on now to try to close things down here in the ninth. Manny Machado is at the plate now, and he takes a cold strike. Machado now on 0 and 1. Here's a cutter that's off the plate 1 and 1. The 1 1 home. And he'll come back with 1 in the dirt as the count moves to 2 and 1 now. Now here's the pitch. At the knees for a called strike, and it's back to even at 2 and 2. Now the 2-2 pitch. And the knuckle curve oh. freezes him as he becomes out number one. Uh. <laughs> James Loney will dig in again. He singled home a run his last time. First pitch coming. Now a hard liner towards short, but right at the shortstop for the second out. Jared Saltalamacchia will stand in. Base on balls his last time. First pitch. And he'll look at a first pitch curveball that's in the dirt. It's ball one. The 1 0. That's wide, 2 and 0. And with two away here, this is not the time to lose the strike zone. Especially not to a number nine hitter. The last thing you want to do is turn this lineup over and give these guys a shot to make something out of this inning after all. Lay the fastball in here to get the count back to two and one. And there's a called strike two as now they're down to their final strike this afternoon. Sets the two two pick. Hit high but foul as that'll get in amongst the fans. 
And a full house here at Fenway. 36,984 on their feet. And good patience to hold back on the curveball in the dirt. It's full now. Three and two. D. Gordon would be next. Swing and a miss. He struck him out, and that'll do it here as the ball game is over. Oh, oh, I can't win a game. I He's cannot win a freaking game. Time, but somehow they're the ones I'm getting so after it's all irritated said with this game. The one game where I hit pretty well, I still lose. I'm getting so tired of this game. Oh, this game irritates me so much. It's like this game just intentionally prevents me from winning. Plenty of offense here in this one as we give you one final look at the line score. And quite a lot of offense in this one, but if we had to highlight one guy that made the difference, there he is. He's our tops player of the game. And I think, all things considered, this was really a team victory. But out of everybody, I agree, he made the biggest impact out there.